Hey guys, what's happening? Welcome back to my channel. Today, I am going to be talking about a highly requested topic that you guys asked me when I filmed the video of me doing my mom's makeup. A lot of you could tell that we didn't really look alike and that I am adopted. So I'm coming today to tell you guys my adoption story. It's not near as juicy as Kim K's ass, but you guys wanted it, so here you go. My two lovely parents decided to adopt my brother. They got him from a lady named Jessica. Just remember that. Like, I know it sounds weird. Why the fuck do y'all even need to know that? But just remember that. They decided to go and adopt again, and they adopted my sister. They adopted my sister from, like, some random people. Well, I mean, they were all random people, but you know what I mean. I feel like my hair is going to annoy me. I don't know. I'm not going to let it get to me. I'm not going to let it get to me. No. I mean, not today, not today, not today, not today, not today. Okay, okay, okay. I think I'm good now. I think I'm good now. They got a call from Jessica, not from Jessica. They got a call saying that Jessica was having another baby. <coughs> Me. And that they wanted to know if my parents wanted to adopt me to keep the siblings, us as siblings like me and my brother together because they wanted to keep all the siblings together if they possibly could. My parents said yes. I don't even know why, but my parents said yes and they adopted me. That's basically the story and some like questions I always get are if I'm ever going to meet my real mom and it's actually been like hitting me like holy shit I turned 18 in three weeks and I think I have the choice if I want to to see if I can meet her or not when I turn 18. <gasps> Just the thought of going to a random person you've never seen in your entire life and having to like accept the fact that that's the person that gave birth to you that you're half of them oh my god that's just ugh, that's weird do i hug her do i just like high five her do i just fist bump i don't i don't know what to do when i i don't know i feel like it's gonna be like hella awkward hella fucking awkward i i don't even know when I was like a really young babby, my father passed away from drug overdose. I never got to meet him, obviously, because... So he's kind of out of the picture, and it's just my mom. But I'm still tripping out about the fact, what if I've come across and actually held a conversation with, or hugged, or even touched, or even breathed in the same air as somebody who's related to me in some way whatsoever like really like blood related what what if i've even come across and had a conversation with my mother and i didn't even know i mean i, I probably would I, I don't know i would probably think like wow this bitch looks like me and that's really never dawned my mind going up to like going up to a random person and or just walking around and just seeing the people around me like oh that looks like my mom i that's never ever ever come across my mind so i guess if that does that's what i should worry about though but, you know. i view my parents as my parents you know mom and dad pretty cool people a lot of times people will ask me if it's weird knowing that i live with my half brother i mean yeah, it is, but I'm just kind of like, he's nasty. <laughs> I mean, it, it's like, it, it's all good. I mean, I guess I'm just used to that. When I actually spend time thinking about it, that is really, really cool that I live with my half-brother. I don't know, that's just cool to me. Can we just take a moment for like this makeup though? I'm proud. I'm a proud ass bitch. I was told that I was adopted actually when I was super, super young, which I'm really thankful for because I'm glad they didn't like hide that shit behind my back. I think I would have really, really like, it would have hit me differently if I had found out when I was older. 
I always remembered getting asked a lot of questions in, especially in elementary school, in middle school. Why doesn't your mom look like you at all? Blah, 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 blah. It was kind of awkward, but since I had known at a young age, like as a kid, I kind of knew how to just take it in and like accept it. Not only do I have my brother though, I actually have three other siblings out there somewhere in the world that I don't even know about. Well, I know about, but I don't. That's pretty crazy too, because then again, that trips me out again. Like, what if I run into them? Oh my god, that's crazy. Like I said, I told you guys, I know it's not something super big and... It was... But it was. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm such a piece of shit such a mess. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will link down below all of my social media if you're interested in following that. I have Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, you now, Spotify. Oh my god, everyone's been asking me for my Spotify recently. So, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys. It's Megan.Lee5678. And if you want to listen to, like, my weird ass music, go ahead. Another thing I wanted to cover real quick before I ended this video is a lot of you, a lot of you have asked me to post a hair care routine video. And that video would honestly be a 30 second long video. So I thought, hey, now we gonna just slide it right in here. So, I don't do shit to my hair. I get in the shower, I wash it and shampoo and condition it with Pantene, I get out, put it in a towel, and I take it down and let it dry. I don't even blow dry it. I do nothing with my hair. I don't put any products in it. Water and shampoo and Pantene conditioner. So that's that. I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm sorry. Like, I wish I had a hair care routine. Like, shit. I've just accepted that it's going to be a dysfunctional mess like me. So that's why I don't even try to do anything. I just let it be. Thank you guys so much for watching again. I think I already said that. I hope you have a wonderful, fantastic, beautiful day or night wherever you are. I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys in... That is not my... What the hell? You guys already know. I'll catch you in my next video. Bye, guys.